Hi, check, check, check. One, two, check. So, who's here? Give me a shout out. Say hi. I am live, guys, after a very long time. And I thought it's a good time to talk to you guys and see what's up. Hi, hi, guys. First, Goose Flatter. Yes, you are first, I guess. The package, yes, you too. Hi from Brazil. Hi. Hi from Delhi. Hello, guys. It's time we chat. It's been a very long time since I came live and I thought I should go live today because I have so much interesting, so many interesting things to share with you. So let's get on it. Oh, yes, we're getting people from everywhere. Lots from India, lots from uh, Turkey, France. Hi, hi, guys. Germany, Germany, Brazil. Hey, hi from Canada. Hi from Bangladesh, from Germany. Hey, guys, love you all. Thank you so much for joining in for my chat. Uh, I've been wanting to talk to you guys about so many things. Uh, past few videos have been really awesome. Your reactions. I try to read each and every comment. But the past couple of months have been really busy. So I'm not able to reply as frequently as I usually do. So sorry for that. Anyway, what's up, guys? Um, tell me what you're up to. And uh, are you coming to Spain? Oh, yes. So this is... Um, one of my big announcements that I wanted to do, let me just go through the comments once. Okay, Net Hazard says, you're simply magnificent. Love your stuff. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, and uh, hello from the United States. Hi, guys. I have a lot of viewers from uh, US, and that's pretty cool. Uh, so I, I don't think a lot, as many people watch my videos here in India as they do in US, in Germany and uh, France and uh, you know a few more countries like that which is quite surprising but I know why <laughs> but it's pretty awesome that I have such diverse audience and uh, you guys like what I do so thank you thank you so much hi from Norway hey so, you know I've always been very interested towards Norway I, I wonder how it's like I'd love to come there sometime love from Karnataka that's my um but that's my country state one of the states of my country hi i'm a piper hi hello uh, i love your beautiful smile <laughs> thank you i used to not really think i have a very good smile I've, I've always grown up and been very conscious about my smile i don't know what so off late i've been trying to get comfortable with my smile and pose like a teethy picture and all my pictures like <laughs> anyway uh yes um Okay, so since a lot of you Sp uh, Spanish people have been asking, are you coming to my country, reading the title, yes, I am coming to Spain. So finally, um, I've been dying to announce this, but I'm like a very uh, secretive person when it comes to, I have to make sure everything is confirmed, tickets are booked, things are done, only then will I tell people, I don't want to jinx anything, so yes, I'm coming to Spain, guys, um, and very, very soon, in fact, in another few days, I'm uh, going to be reaching Spain uh, in Galicia, actually, 7th of June, and I have a show uh, on 9th of June at, the, that's the 33rd Ba International Backpipe Festival in Galicia, Oranze, and um, I've been invited there to play among uh, really renowned backpipers, and it's a very, very prestigious um, backpipe festival, um, and it's been a privilege and it's been an honor that they actually wanted to invite me and have me play there, so I think, um, in fact, I am going to be the first Indian uh, backpiper they are going to have on their stage. So how cool is that? <laughs> Lots of firsts in my career, I think. <laughs> but uh, I think it's very, very, very exciting. Uh, let's go. I'm going to come back to the Spain thing. Um, at the meantime, I want to look at the comments and try to reply to any questions if you guys have. Hi from Germany. Hi from Brazil. Hi, guys. Hi, from, hi to all of you out there. Um, and uh, I am a piper, lots of love. And can I ask a question? Yeah, like shoot your questions. Uh, are you coming to my country? Yes. And um, 
Hello from North Carolina. And yes, you have an amazing smell when you will be in the USS. Trey Adams. Hi, Trey. I have been speaking to some promoters in the US. Uh, nothing concrete yet. But yeah, why not? I'd love to come and perform in the US. So yes. Hello from hello from Punjab. Hey, hi. Um, anyone want that she play live now? Nice hair. Nice hair. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. <laughs> and um, yes. So uh, about my show in uh, about my show in Spain. So 9th June, I'm going to perform at Galicia at. Um, the Orenzo so that's where I'm going to be performing it's going to be more of my solo performance uh, I'll try to get a video of this performance and post it on YouTube for you all to check it out but yes if you are in Spain and if you are near San Diego de Compostela you know where to come on 9th June you can see me live come say a hi I would love to meet you guys um, in fact the good thing is I'm going to be in Spain for almost three weeks. So I'm just not going to come to Spain and go back in three days, am I? No, I'm not. So I'm going to um, going to come to Madrid, um, even in Barcelona, uh, mostly to visit and see Spain because this is going to be my first time in Spain. So I'm even thinking if uh, you are located in Madrid or Barcelona, I would love to organize a meet and greet where I would love to meet uh, my viewers, my fans and say hi, probably have, uh, you know, sip a coffee with you all and just chat, you know, just get to know you guys in person one to one and hey, I'm all free there. So I would love to see you guys. So yeah, let me know in the comments below if you are in Spain during that time or if you live there in Madrid or Barcelona and if you would like to like me to organize a meet and greet. I would love to do that. Um, let's go back to the comments. Uh, going back to the comments. Is that a Tinkerbell tattoo? Uh, no, it's not a Tinkerbell. A lot of people have asked me that. It's supposed to be a angel. And you usually have heard that angels have uh, their soul in their wings. So there's a treble clef right here somewhere. If you can see, it's not very clear. I know the video isn't very clear. But yeah, so basically music in my soul. That's what it denotes. And I got it, you know, a really long time back. I think about seven, seven, eight years back. So yeah. Things you do when you're not so sane. But I really love it. I, I, I like it. I'm cool with it. <laughs> no regrets. And um, uh, yeah, come to Turkey. Uh, actually, I was supposed to come to Turkey. Uh, let me tell you that. Uh, this uh, May, I was supposed to come to Turkey. And everything was almost finalized for a three-city, uh, for actually one-city tour in Istanbul. But um, uh, things were not working out at the last moment. Something happened. But we're trying to reorganize that. And I might come back to Turkey with a bigger tour, probably like a three-city tour. So, yes, definitely. Misut Gun. Hi, so you're asking if I would come to Turkey. So that's the answer I would probably very soon. Let's see. And um, yeah, now next big announcement is I am releasing a new video tomorrow. Yes. So I'm going to be releasing my new video tomorrow, guys. And I would absolutely want you to watch this video because, um, you know, I've been doing If you see my channel, you'll see different types of videos, different types of music from themes to metal to dubstep to so many other, other things, you know. And uh, it's been awesome to see that people actually like that diversity I bring in. But this time I've tried to experiment a little more and do something very, very different. And uh, to give you a hint, mix some ethnic sounds from my home country, from India. And um, I've gotten a lot of people on board for this video. I've collaborated with Highland dancers all the way from Great Britain. Um, I have a lovely violin player. Um, from Russia who lives here and then I have a um, very good Indian folk dance group, a Bhangra group. So I'm not going to say all of it. You have to watch the video guys. I, I, I mean, I really like how the song has come out too. I wanted to experiment like this for a long time, but I really absolutely, you guys are the ultimate judge. And uh, as much as I love it, 
I would absolutely want you guys to like it and you guys to enjoy it too. So tomorrow, um, probably, you know, a, a few more hours before right now, <laughs> because you're all in different time zones. So I don't know what to say, what time, but uh, yeah, probably 7.30 PM IST, Indian Standard Time. That's when I would be releasing my new video. So catch it and do not miss this video, please. And let me know when you see this video, right? So tomorrow, we're not gonna miss this Nick Chalmers video, we're gonna watch it. So anyway, um, I'm gonna go back to comments now. Best looking black widow ever. <laughs> Thank you, that's uh, Christopher Peterson who says that. Hi, Christopher, Christopher. I'm sure people call you this, I just got that on my tongue. Yeah, actually, I love the black widow costume too. Um, um, I've been very, very casual with most of my videos, but on this video, I wanted to really do a good cosplay. And thankfully, I got that costume here. To be honest, Delhi, even India, they're not too big on cosplay costumes. And it's really, really tough to get a good costume that does not look stupid. <laughs> so I had to really, really make an effort to find it. And I found it. So yeah, that, that was totally my efforts. Thank you, guys. Thank you. <laughs> and uh, what else? Spain is lucky. Thank you. Dylan M. Uh, hello from America. Yes, Seti. Um, damn it is. Um, some Korean, I think, scripture. Respect from Korea, of course, South Law. <laughs> Enjoying your excellent video. Good, ma'am. Thank you so much. Yeah, of course, North Koreans probably cannot access YouTube live videos. Good humor there. And um, any show in Mumbai? Uh, yes, most probably coming in a few months. I've not been to Mumbai for a long time now. Usually I used to perform there quite often. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to start doing that more. Uh, hold on, guys. There are a lot of comments I need to go back and check out. Um, yeah. Um, so what? I'll have my birthday tomorrow. Thanks. Oh, great. So good way. You have to uh, cut your cake and listen to my song then. Um, everybody hit do you like button, please. Thank you. Um, and so basically, this is my house. Uh, this is my room. I'm not uh, going live from the studio this time. I'm going live from my house. And uh, it's really very, very extremely freaking hot in Delhi. Thankfully, today it was a little better, but it, it's been really, really, really hot. In fact, I have Rambo here. Let me get you. Rambo! Rambo, see? Who's that? Okay, Rambo is up. Special appearance of Rambo. Hey guys, that's my baby Rambo. Hi Rambo. Hi. That's Rambo. He's a boxer. And this boy is four years old. And we all love him so much. Hey, come here, come here, come here. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so do you see him? He's my cutie boy. Hi Rambo. Say hi. He's a really smart dog. He is a really smart dog. In fact, our neighbors tell, uh, you know, they tell us, oh, we didn't even know you guys have a dog because he really does not bark and irritate or he doesn't bark too much. And you see, he was he was right next to my feet till now. You guys didn't probably even notice. So that's Rambo. Rambo knows a lot of tricks. And I'm being so mean. He was kind of sleeping and I just woke him up because of you guys. So you better write some good comments for Rambo. So it was worth him, worth for him to get up. <laughs> okay, Rambo, go to sleep. Okay. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. So that was my pet voice. I go all squeaky. Anyway, so yeah, let, let me just uh, quickly read some uh, comments. Um, yeah. Uh, when you get to the States, first round is on me. If you bring the pipes with you, I'll bring the washboard and harmonica, says Dustin Dixon. Margit Way, love your music. And um, thanks, thanks, thanks. I'll have my birthday tomorrow. And uh, hi, it's Ken. Uh, Amy Povey says, hi, it's Kenzie and Amy. We are two of the dancers that will be in your new video. Oh, fantastic. That is awesome. <coughs> I'm going to tag you guys when I know your handles. I would love to 
uh, tell people about you guys. Um, Karthikeyan Ramakrishna says, Pirates of the Caribbean is the best till date. Thank you. I know, I love that music too. I think, uh, in fact, I'm going to perform that uh, song in Spain. And I think that's the first time I'm going to be performing that song ever. So that's pretty cool. Um, awesome music. Do you uh, keep it up? Thank you, Ron. And... Um, I think, she, um, please come, Rohit Singh, I think she don't know how to play. She play only with the software. That's why she's ignoring us. What? Okay, I need to know what back history you are saying, Rohit Singh. I don't know what you mean. But anyway, we get such comments every time, so it's not a big deal. Um, please come to Bangalore, Srinidhi, Chandrasekhar. Guys, um, break a leg. Here's to you guys having a blast. Thank you. Uh, Sanjeev Kumar says, Archie Rockstar, thank you. So guys, if in case, because I'm so known by the Snake Charmer, if you don't know my name, my name is Archie, Archie J. That's how you can find me on Facebook, Instagram. Uh, you can find me as the Snake Charmer, Backpiper. You can find me on Instagram like that. Um, David De Silva says, hello from South Africa. Please play live. No. Uh, new video tomorrow. Great. Yes, it is. Um, Ryan True says, I just tuned in and love your videos. I wanted to know how you got into backpipes. So yeah, this is something I've been saying uh, in a lot of uh, interviews that I gave and even my last video. But I know new people join in, so you want to know. Uh, I got into backpipes because um, the, you know, attracted and wanting to do something different every time. I'm always drawn to things that are uh, a little uncommon not something that everybody is doing and stuff like that. So when I saw uh, LYT's video on YouTube for the first time, I was like, oh my God, this is like the coolest thing ever. And instantly I felt like I want to leave everything and I want to learn the bagpipes. So that was my first in, uh, you know, that was my first encounter with my interest towards bagpipes and since then there's no looking back and now see uh, from just an inception of an idea this, this is now my life this is the reality yeah, i'm being called to spain because of that little thought in my head that i want to do that and i pursued it so yeah if you guys think of some crazy ideas know that it's never crazy um you know when you when you go after it and when you accomplish your crazy idea people would want to follow you. You know, the same people who thought you were crazy and who thought your idea was crazy. So keep doing different stuff, people, and don't be don't be worried about doing anything of that sort. And um, hi, hi, hello from Argentina, Leandro Ariel Baez says. Um, and um, uh, um, Gus Flatter should cover Lords of Iron, Celtic met Metal. Um, Hi, I'm a hi Archie. I'm a pro, pre, apprentice blacksmith, and soon will have my own YouTube channel. Soon, how do you spell your name? A R C H Y. That's how I spell my name. A R C H Y. Um, okay. Anything in the USA, John Ho? Um, soon, maybe soon, but nothing confirmed, so I can't say as of now. But there have been things happening. There have been offers coming. So yeah, let's let's see which one works out. Okay. Um, then Kathy Holly says, do a James Bond theme. Okay. Okay. I'll keep that in mind and I'll keep that in mind and see. Um, and then Abin Crow, where are on who from? I don't know what that means. Um, then crazy, uh, Josh Salazar. Hey Josh. So Josh is my Patreon. If you don't know about Patreon, um, Patreon is a website that I am on. Uh, it's a very good way to support me. In fact, it's the best way to show your support towards me. Um, through Patreon, you can pledge any amount from $1 to 10 to as much as you want. And every month I release a video, your contributions come directly to me. So it actually helps massively to me uh, for me to make videos and finance my videos and be able to pay people off and get things going. In fact, I remember when I was not really earning through music, my ideas would be so restricted because there are so many things you cannot do without uh, without money, you know. And now, uh, thankful thanks to people like... Uh, Josh and so many of my other Patreons who pledge uh, generously to me every month for my videos. Because of them, I'm able to create 
different videos for you guys so if any of you really like what i do and there's no pressure do it only if you want to um and if you'd like to support me if you'd like to help me because i get a lot of comments how do we contribute or how do we support you so this is the best way to support me guys uh, just go to patreon.com slash the snake trauma and uh, you can pledge any amount and uh, it, you know it's a very legit site nothing goes wrong there and you only get charged when i put a video and i put a video only once a month so uh, you get a lot of rewards too i do personal video chats uh, like a skype one on one too with all my patrons above 10 dollars with pl pledge above 10 dollars you get all my tracks for free and just i get to know you more personally it's my close circle i uh, stay quite in touch with all my patrons and if tomorrow i grow that much and i become like a bigger uh, personality or whatever i would love to give away free tickets to my concerts and just so many more things so check it out and if you'd like please do become my patreon and um, josh says it's great to get to be in the credits at the end of each video yeah that's another point so uh, as a thank you to all my patrons whenever my video gets over you'll see a long list of names scrolling up so those are the names of my patrons who support me um and that's just by way of saying thank you to them right um so yeah and um have you thought of playing a little old fashioned pipe music like bonnie portmore maybe collab with a singer storm king says um yeah that's a good uh, that's a good question in fact my next video uh, let me break it down to you that's coming out tomorrow i'm going to be playing a traditional bagpipe tune but i'm going to mix them up mix it up and spice it up with something completely different so you've got to check that out i will be doing a more traditional bagpipe songs too or you know a little old fashioned bagpipe tunes and i could probably take it up as a challenge and do something completely different with it definitely um and collaboration with a singer sure i i would be in fact my brother keeps telling me oh i want you to sing in your videos cuz uh, for for people who don't know <clears throat> i sing uh, i used to be uh, the lead vocalist in my band uh, before getting into bagpipes and everything of that sort in fact i used to sing since i was like what 6 6 years old so yeah i used to singing was my main thing and then when bagpipes happened that just went to the back side so i've been thinking to sing in um, you know in one of my videos maybe sing and collab let's see let's see let's see and um okay and who else uh, thank you for the facebook page name liked and following your youtube also more heavy metal music please five finger death death punch megareth and of course acdc ryan home writes thanks ryan and keep following like i said i'm getting into different types of music now um i will come back to metal as well i will be doing that as as well but i'm right now in the zone of experiments experimenting with something that people like and would want to listen to more right so yeah if you have any recommendations any requests please do write that uh, tara dm says i'm spanish where will you be performing so i think you just joined in uh, and if you did i will be i will be performing in spain uh, on 9th june in galicia uh, galicia orenzo that's um, in the castello castle uh, if i'm pronouncing it wrong i'll leave the details in the description of where i'm performing what time and what day um, in fact the best thing about the entire trip besides the uh, show is that i'll also be appearing in uh, one of the actually the most famous tv program that's what i've been told in galicia um, just hang on a second i'm going to take the name of that show yeah so this is going to be a uh, tvg that's the channel tvg program is luar luar apparently it's a uh, very famous in galicia and uh, all everybody knows it and i am going to be called as a guest to perform on that show so how cool is that i'm going to be on tv and not <laughs> i mean in spain all the way so that's pretty cool that's really really cool and i'm looking forward to going there and doing all of these awesome things uh selling dijan says much love from east coast of usa we love you thanks i love you too and um who else uh, evanescence my immortal yeah i, I love that song <laughs> 
just seems like yesterday, but it's such a great song. Um, I like your music. Greetings from Belgium, says Georges Op de Beek. Oh, interesting name. Um, then um, a beautiful twist in mind says, we love you in Canada. Thank you. Um, I love Canada too. In fact, I used to live there some time back and then we all came back to India. But yeah, Canada is great. Um, Alfonso Yurdat says, I can't stop listening to Power Rangers team. Thanks, man. Power Rangers was such a hard song to nail. Oh my God. That was one of the toughest songs that I recorded on bagpipes. Um, it was really tough, especially the solo. And I have not practiced that for such a long time. So I really need to go back and still try to play it. You know what I'm saying? But uh, the best thing about Power Rangers um, uh, cover and Power Rangers video was when I heard back from Ron Wasserman. Uh, he's such an ace music composer. He's the one who composed the Power Rangers theme. And when I saw his comment on my video saying, best bagpipe playing ever uh, that, that I've ever seen, I was totally flattered. I mean, that just meant so much for me. So, uh, yeah, that uh, it just reminded me when you mentioned about that video. Um, okay. And... Um, Love you from Bali, Indonesia. Oh, thank you. I love Bali. I've, I've been to Indonesia, Bali, and I love the place. It's so happening, so alive. Man, I love that place. Uh, greetings from Boston, says Dogman Rocks. Uh, if you're a dog man, I love dogs. Hey, you just saw my dog. And uh, King Dugan, I love you. I love you too. Um, Michael Archer says, what about Ark Enemy? Your world is yours. Okay. Um, hey, I'm your huge fan, says Piyush Katyar. Thanks, Piyush. Thanks a lot. And um, yeah, so these are the comments that I am sure I missed a lot of comments in between because I've been talking to you guys. Um, and in next video, I'm going to be uh, getting my music producer too. And um, we're going to discuss some more things with you guys and tell you a little more insights. Today, I just wanted to do a quick video chat with you guys, telling you about my trip to Spain, my gig to Spain. In fact, um, I have been uh, approached by a few uh, you know venues in spain but yeah if you if you would like me to perform in one of your venues either in barcelona or madrid let me know i would love to uh, because i'm anyway going to be visiting there so if you have anybody in mind that you know who has a venue or if you are a venue owner and if you'd like me to perform there get in touch with me i'll leave my details in the description or in the comments below my email id and my business email id so you can get in touch with me there um uh, so somebody says, Sandra, Sangha, with teacher or by yourself? Um, if you mean, how did I, ha I love backpipe sound, but how do you learn to play backpipes? Oh, okay. So that's a question. Yeah. So a lot of people know that I am a self-taught backpiper, uh, mostly self-taught. So initially the entire two years, I learned on my own. Then I went to Scotland briefly. But again, that was just like a five-day course. I love my teachers there. And they really loaded me with a lot of knowledge. But then uh, it was uh, a long time of practicing and pursuing the instrument, um, you know, all by myself. So, yeah, I I've been mostly a self-taught piper. But then I had very good friends online who helped me uh, and sent me long messages explaining and clearing any confusion I had. So, yeah, I've been a... Um, I've been a self-taught piper that way. And, uh, oh, I, Joey Martin says, I have a question. What happened to your first Star Wars cover? And I can't find it anymore. <laughs> oh, it's kind of set to private now. If you, probably if enough people want, I could bring it back again. But because we did another Star Wars cover and it was, uh, in our opinion, way better and way more professional than the first <laughs> Star Wars cover. So that's why we kind of set it to private so it's not available to view anymore oh is that rambo's ball oh shit that's rambo's ball anyway so guys I, my neck was in a really bad shape until today morning i was not even able to do that and this so when i just look back i felt very good that i'm able to you know like really rotate my neck or twist my neck a little bit yeah i just got a really bad cramp in my neck like a really bad muscle pull and i just 
horrible anyway i'm better now uh so kato says i'm from japan um and um good night midnight taipei time uh and uh who uh, star trek theme what about that one michael archer says that um star trek I i'm not too much into star trek honestly uh but i look into it if there's a month that i don't know what to do i look into playing that probably um yeah so if you guys are in spain again and uh, if you are from madrid and barcelona and if you want to meet me and if you want me to organize a meet and greet and have coffee with me and just get to you know like let's get to know each other personally you guys are my viewers you guys um support me so i'd like to meet you uh, one on one so if you are in madrid or spain in between um what 25th june to 28th june let me know and we'll organize a quick meet and uh, greet with you all right um i think that's it for today um i hope i have um read most of these comments uh, sandra sanga says please come to france okay it's not too far from spain you know i could just take a train and do come but then i don't have that much time at this trip but maybe next time definitely um and uh, what else joey bradley says you are awesome thanks uh wait are, are you coming to america no not right now <laughs> not right now um yep so anyway that's it for today guys um and um, thank you so much for joining in my video chat i will probably make another live chat before i go to spain or uh, or probably when i'm in spain let's see but i want to do this more frequently all right so uh yeah thanks a lot for being such a lovely audience and uh, do catch my video tomorrow tomorrow 7:30 pm ist probably 15 20 minutes here or there i don't know but yeah just around that time um do check it out please share this video because um i really appreciate you liking commenting um on my videos but sharing actually does the magic if you want if you like an artist if you want to support them and if you actually want to help them grow please share their video so please do share my video uh, don't just like and comment and go off uh, share the video with your friends to pages and to people that you know because that's how uh, you could get my word out and get newer people to watch my videos and get to know me right so yes look i'm looking forward for tomorrow and i'm looking forward to 7th june the day i land in spain galicia and i'll keep you guys updated uh do check out my facebook page and if you're on my facebook page um, you know the best way because all these facebook and youtube guys they've all mixed their um you know how we see notifications and what we see first or not so when you go to facebook page just go if you go to the snake charmer page you will see a follow button and under that just uh, tick on see first so if you select see first you will never miss an update from my page and you all know i don't do a lot of updates so it's not like you will be bombarded with posts so i probably post once in a few days <coughs> or maximum once a day you can tolerate me that much right <laughs> so please do that and i'm saying that only so that you guys don't uh, miss any time i update a video or i post a video i don't want you guys to miss that uh, the same goes for youtube uh, the a true subscriber is the one who presses that damn bell notification button i know it's so much for you guys to do subscribe like share comment but what do i do <laughs> these are the only ways so when you subscribe please press that bell notification button right next to it doing that will give you instant notification every time i upload a new video so that's really go uh, that's really cool and that's really good so that you don't miss any of my videos right so yeah on facebook uh, go to uh, the follow button and click on um, see first and on youtube be, besides the subscribe button just press on the bell notification that's all that's all you need to do i promise that's all If you do that you'll see my videos and you'll have a good time right anyway <coughs> so that's it from me today guys i think this is the fourth time i'm saying that i know <laughs> but uh, th that that is really it and i'll see you guys next time 
probably um, sometime in you know in the coming weeks i'll say hi to you again come on live right bye guys love you all love you all so much and thank you all so much for coming and being a part of this live chat catch my video tomorrow and do let me know what you think of it bye thank you so much